Hello everyone, I am Jomua. In this video, I'll be talking about the unusual mammals. Before we actually go into detail for the topic, let's review what mammals are. In short, mammals are warm-blooded animals that nurse their young with milk. Their body is covered with hair or fur. Most of them have four legs. Most of the mammals have these distinctive features and so, by just having a glance, they are easily distinguishable from other groups of mammals. But there are some exceptions and we'll be exploring them now. The first unusual mammal that I'm going to mention is the bat. Like birds, bats also fly in the air, and they have wings too. They look like birds. But if you carefully observe them, you'll notice that their body is covered with hair, not feathers. Bats are actually mammals. Some marine animals, such as whales or dolphins, look like fish. They also live in water and have similar body shapes like shark or other fishes. But their body is covered with hair instead of scales unlike fish and they feed milk to the babies too. As they are mammals, they breathe using their lungs, not gills. Every now and then, they come to the surface of water to breathe oxygen in. The seal in the movie stores oxygen in his lungs. Almost all mammals give birth to their young alive. The mother holds the baby or babies in her womb for some time, which is called gestation period. After that, the babies are delivered alive. This is a very common phenomenon for the mammals. But there are two mammals in the world that do not reproduce in the same way like others. Instead of giving birth, they lay eggs. These animals are found only in Australia, New Zealand and New Guinea areas. They are very unique creatures of these countries. They are the duckbill platypus and the spiny anteater. The duckbill platypus looks similar to a duck. It has a bill or a beak like a duck. And it swims in water like a duck. It even lays eggs. But the difference is its body covering which is fur, not feather, and it's milk secretion for the baby. Ant eater or echidna is so named as it eats mainly ants and termites. It has a long snout and a very long tongue. The mother lays a single soft-shelled leathery egg, and the baby hatches in the mother's pouch after 10 days. It sucks milk from the pores of the milk patches, not the nipples. Let's conclude now. So, in general, majority of mammals have common features, but a few of them are quite unusual. They are different from the most in terms of their body shape, the places they live, and the way they reproduce. Thank you very much for your attention. <laughs>